the sounds of a choreographed exercise regimen echoing across the fields on a golden afternoon. So peaceful, so militant. Make those knives sing. Treat every move like a legit kill strike. You're in the way here, pal. Fizz Ed is my department now. But, but I'm lonely. Find something else to do then, like, I don't know. There's a sandbox, have a field day. <laughs> you don't have to be so insensitive. The kids liked it better when I was their gym coach anyhow. <sighs> yeah, not so much. No offense or anything, it's just when it comes to exercise, you... Set the bar kind of high. All right, let's try a simple jumping side-to-side -side maneuver. Watch closely and I'll show you how it's done. Are you kidding me? Once you got the rhythm, throw some Cat's Cradle into the mix. Wow, he is seriously good! Like we could keep up with that. We're human beings, you know. I, for one, think our coach should be too. <laughs> right. Back to work, people. Can I ask an obvious question, sir? If there's an actual point to this training, should, uh, should we be practicing right in front of our target? Whether killing or studying, it's the same principle. Drill the basics, and they'll serve you well. Okay. Isagai, Mayahara, step up. I want you to try to tag me with those knives. Wait, like as a team? Do you think that's a good idea? The blades are harmless. They weren't designed to injure human beings. Tell you what, manage to hit me, and you can go home for the day. Oh, uh, okay. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> Come on. See that, kids? Even with the bare minimum know-how, I can practically dodge their attacks in my sleep. They've got no technique. Whoa. If you can't land a hit against a guy like me, you haven't got a prayer against a target whose top speed is Mach 20. See? We've been sparring for half a minute, and look. He's had time to change clothes, make tea, and build a model of a Sokka castle. That is so irritating! That's why we drill. When the whole class can hit me, you have a shot. Do what I tell you as often as I tell you to do it, you'll become assassins. This isn't recess, kids. From now on, gym class will be about the basics. Stabbing, correct use of firearms, everything you need to succeed. Wow, well, okay. All right, that ought to do it for today. Thank, Thank you, sir! sir. Hmm. This is so intense. He's terrifying but cool at the same time. I know. He wants you to hurt him, but he'll pat you on the head if you do it right. He's a good coach. I know what this is. You're trying to take my place as their favorite teacher! Really? I'm here by assignment. Like it or not, as per your contract, and I quote, all new hires regarding E-Class are solely the prerogative of Kanugi Gauka Academy. <laughs> And either way, this is not a popularity contest. It's my job. I'm here to help them kill you, pal. Could you not call me that, please? I prefer the name my students gave me. So that's Koro Sensei to you. Uh, we've got a quiz in sixth period. Right? They should just let us go home after gym. Uh. Nagisa, sir. It's been a while. Karma, you're back? すると気それが過去いいことを知ってる
Oh, hey. That must be the notorious Koro Sensei. Wow, he really does look like an octopus. Ah, Mr. Akabane, correct? I understand your suspension ends today. Welcome back. That said, tardiness is a no-no. <laughs> it's kind of tricky getting back into the swing of things. Oh, feel free to call me by my first name. Anyway, I've heard some good things, Teach. Nice to meet you. The pleasure's all mine. Should be a fun and educational year. <laughs> ah, you are fast, aren't you? <laughs> and who'd have thought these knives actually work? I just cut one up into strips and tacked them on. Pretty elementary stuff, Chief. I'm disappointed that's all it took to catch you by surprise. But good jump, if you don't mind coming off like a fraidy cat. What, are you scared of me? He heard him. He actually heard it. That makes him the first. I heard they call you Koro Sensei because you're supposed to be unkillable. <laughs> oh, come on. No way you can be this big of a pushover. Hey, Nagisa, what kind of person is this karma guy? Uh, he and I were in the same class our first and second year. He was violent. So violent, they finally expelled him, shipped him here. E-class is where they send you when they don't know what else to do with you. Thing is, under the circumstances, he may end up a star student. Huh? What do you mean? Weapons and blood are his passion. Trust me, if anyone can kill our teacher, it's karma. Stick around next time, Koro-sensei. I'll show you what it's like to be assassinated. You won't want to miss it. Um, what is he doing? I don't know, I think he's punching the wall. No, you're right. Karma's smack talk seems to have really touched a nerve. But what's the point of punching a wall when his tentacles are too soft to do any damage? Okay, that's enough! Could you maybe stop that? We're trying to take a quiz here! S sorry, yes, uh, absolutely. You sure you know what you're getting yourself into, Karma? The jellyfish is sincerely pissed off at you. You can't pay me enough to be in your shoes. If I was you, I'd stay at home with my head under a pillow. Of course he's pissed. Who wouldn't be if someone made an attempt on their life? Lest the would-be assassin screwed up and pissed himself in the process. Uh, I didn't piss myself! That attitude's gonna get your ass kicked! Quiet, please! No noise during a quiz! Tell that Continue to, to talk, and I will assume that you're cheating! Sorry, Koro-sensei, my bad. No worries, though, I've already finished. I'm just gonna eat this gelato, if that's okay. Not so fast! No eating in class! <laughs> Hey! That's the gelato I brought back from Italy yesterday! Uh, huh? Sorry. My bad. I just saw it chilling in the faculty lounge. This won't do, young man! I flew through the coldest layer of the stratosphere to keep that delicious treat from melting! Yeah? So, what are you gonna do? Hit me? Of course not! I'll simply have it back and finish what's left, thank you very much. <laughs> anti me BBs? <laughs> wow, that's twice in one day, Teach. Yeah. I'm gonna keep pulling the same old tricks. Class will get interrupted, our grades will slip. Let's be straight up, though. If you want this to stop, you can just kill me. Or anyone else in this class, for <laughs> that matter. You just gotta let go of wanting us to see you as our teacher. Give us a taste of your ugly side. Or you can make peace with all this. Except that I'll be the one to kill you. Here's my quiz. Easy peasy. Peace out for now, Teach. What do you say we play again tomorrow? Karma's not afraid to go there. He knows exactly what buttons to push. Case in point, he drew a line in the sand Koro Sensei couldn't cross without changing the way we all saw him. It took nerve. It also took honing in on his target's weakness. He's clever. He's manipulative. He's ice cold. He sees what makes you tick and how to exploit it. If anyone can do this, it's him. That boy? He's left me with no choice but to go buy another gelato. He's sharp. Deviously clever. Mustn't let him bait me. Mustn't give him the satisfaction of losing my temper and killing him. 
I am the teacher, he is the student. Yes, indeed. I'll have to be exceptionally careful with that one. See you later, Nagisa. Bye! Have a good one! Are you kidding me? Is that actually Nagisa? Look at that guy, all cozy with the E-Class dumbasses. Ew, gross. Gotta hand it to him. He's adapted to the crowd he's gonna spend the rest of his life with. Hey, did you hear the news? Now that his suspension's over, they shoved that Akabane nut over to E-Class. Ooh, dude, no kidding? I'd rather be dead than stuck in a classroom with that freak. <laughs> Seriously? Because I can help you out with that. It'd be messy, but real quick. I'd rather live, thanks! <laughs> Run away! <laughs> like I'd actually do anything, right? I'm not gonna risk another suspension with the once-in-a-lifetime deal they're giving me in E-Class. Uh, hey. Yeah, hey, Nagisa. Is it cool if I pick your brain for a sec? Word is that you've been keeping notes on the octopus. Um, well, yeah, I kinda have. Does he hate that nickname? Us calling him Octopus, I mean? Now that you mention it, whenever he draws himself, it's always as an octopus. And that's the skinny pics for his characters in every video game. And there's this thing he does in the sandbox. Octopus trap. So no, I don't think he minds at all. In fact, I think it's like his personal avatar or whatever, you know? He loves it. Does he? That's good. Oh, this is gonna be freaking epic. I know that look. You're cooking up something really dark. I might be. It's fun, right? I was into this when I thought he was just a monster, but... Now that I know what his personality is like... I finally get to kill an honest-to-goodness teacher! <laughs> I've been dreaming of this ever since my last teacher up and died. My gelato funds, gone, pinched right out from under my nose, and with payday and eternity away, guess I'll have to make my own now. Good morning, boys and girls. Yeah? Why the long faces? Has something... Oops, that's on me. Yeah, I totally thought it was you. Innocent mistake. I stabbed it, so I suppose I should get rid of it? <sighs> yes, you should. Bring it on, Koro-sensei. No worries, I don't plan on killing you physically yet. It's more fun to watch your spirit die first. <laughs> Observe, if you will, Karma, my boy, the versatility of these tentacles and the firepower of this missile yoinked from the self-defense force. If you think I'm going to let the new kid get away with murder, think again. <clears throat> Don't you know breakfast is the most important meal of the day? Your complexion tells me you haven't eaten, so please help yourself to some of this delicious takoyaki. I insist. You see... I'm a giver. I take care of things. Hungry students, would-be assassins, troubled teens. Every attempt on my life is an opportunity for me to play my part. So by all means, keep at it. By the end of the day, if your body and mind are to glow with health and knowledge, I haven't done my job. As you can see, whatever we do, this number remains. Now, I know the concept of indivisibility is a beast, but if its fangs frighten you, I have a surefire method for taming it. See if you can get the gist as I write it out on the board. Karma, it takes an anti-me BB far too long to reach its mark. I had time on my hands. Hope you don't mind if I prettified yours. Let's see now. How'd the two of you do, Fua? I'm not totally sure. It's got a bizarre tangy flavor to it for some reason. Let's give it a taste. Probably easier if you just start over from scratch. Why not toss it out? We wear an apron in home ec, Karma. <laughs> oh, and don't worry. The soup is fine. I siphoned it out of thin air and put it back in the pot. I also added a dash of sugar. <gasps> That's exactly what it needed! <laughs> Cute outfit. It's no use. Oh. 
over that little pool. Koro Sensei has weaknesses. We all do. He screws up every now and then, and his speed drops to human levels whenever he's flustered, sure. But Karma's been so relentless with his surprise attack. Even as I was thinking this, the Red Frog, having failed again, was making its way back. I was starting to get bored with it. He has Koro Sensei on high alert. I began throwing them at and the that sand. means I was not no dice. To the frog, but to startle it so it would look around. Come on, man. I'm telling you not to sweat it. We'll do it together as a group. <laughs> you could have the sneakiest, most foolproof plan in the world ready to go. But if Koro Sensei's got his eye on you, forget it. He's not like other teachers. Other teachers, huh? No. I'm with you 100%, Akabani. Yes, you've had problems. Yes, you have issues respecting authority. But you're absolutely in the right, not a question. And I stand by you. Hm. You don't understand. I want to do it on my own. Let me ask you, would it tick you off to die in some random place? Oh, karma! <laughs> I feel I've taken exceptionally good care of you today. Keep trying to kill me if that tickles your fancy. I certainly don't get tired of spiffing you up. <laughs> Just so we're on the same page here. You pretty much consider yourself a teacher above all else? <sighs> That's right. Cool. And you wouldn't think twice about putting your life on the line to save a student. What sort of teacher would I be if I did? That's awesome. Good to know. So, I can kill you. Knew there had to be a way. Uh, uh, What's it gonna be, Teach? You gonna swoop down to save me and get blasted in the process? Or are you gonna be the sort of teacher who lets one of your kids die? <laughs> Whoa, that crap they say about your life flashing before your eyes is true. I think he's learned his lesson. 3E? E? The one out in the sticks? Dude, that sucks. Still, don't let anyone give you lip over it. What? I'm not the bad guy here. All I did was put a bully in his place. Little jerk had it coming. No, damn it, Akabane. Any way you slice it, you're clearly in the wrong. Are you out of your mind or just stupid? What possessed you to think attacking your class's star pupil like a mad dog was something I'd let slide? But... Sir, he was... What, talking badly about the dregs? Good for you, injuring someone on principle. This young man happens to have a future. If this interferes with his exams, it's on my head. He said he'd stand by me. So much for that, I guess. Damn, I'm totally gonna die. I've been willing to turn a blind eye on account of your grades, but you've tried my patience once too often. Throw a monkey wrench into my career and all bets are off. I'm not saving you anymore. This is it? This is how it's gonna go down. The good news is I filed the paperwork for your transfer just this afternoon. Best thing for all involved, really. But the bad news is you'll be commencing third year in E-Class. Son of a bitch screwed me over. So that's it. He's dead to me now. What are you waiting for, Koro-sensei? Let's do this! You either die for real or I kill your reputation! Well done! A splendidly premeditated assassination attempt. Full marks. Neat, huh? I knew your body couldn't take being plucked out of freefall at the speed of sound, and had I moved any slower, you would have shot me. What a tangled and sticky web we weave, eh? What the hell? Is there anything these tentacles aren't capable of? Can't shoot me now, can you? <laughs> oh, and for future reference, students do not die on my watch. Ever. Take that to heart for the next time you jump. <laughs> I got nothing. Unfreaking believable. He won't die. The teacher in him, especially. I don't get it. How were you so calm the whole time? Eh, no big. What really sucks is that was my best bet. Nothing else I can come up with even touches it. Aw, run out of ideas already? 
but I have an entire beauty regimen lined up just for you. Come on, no way you can be this big of a pushover. I still feel like killing something. Except, it's different this time somehow. No worries, Teach. You're still dead meat. That's the spirit. Never give up. Seems my tender loving care has paid off. Hmm. Well, let's head back, Nagisa. We can grab some food on the way. No! Oh! Excuse me! That's my purse! Come on, Teach. You've got to stop leaving stuff unattended in the faculty lounge. Give it back! Here you go. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give <laughs> Uh, hey, uh, this is uh, empty. <laughs> and there wasn't much there to begin with. Call it a donation. A donation? A donation? Every time one of us goes in for the kill, we miss the mark, but somehow end up better off. That's the way it goes in our assassination classroom. I can't wait to see how we try to kill our teacher tomorrow. Kawa no kaba 